Welcome back, it's glitch time today and I will show you a glitch that is already known by a couple of people but it is a really nice trick. It is not so super overpowered because it is relatively special but you will see what I mean when I show it to you. And I will also show you how you can combine different glitches to deal more damage and to get some insane numbers to show off to your friend. So stay tuned and check it out. Around mid of May there was a video where I explained you the Aris Madness glitch. As you know Aris Madness is amplifying your damage in the Greek world by a factor of 7. But then suddenly within the Aris Madness video there was a hit that was totally out of range. It was a 56 million damage hit. And that occurred because I hit the polar mark from behind and that gave me an additional boost, a 4 times damage boost. So in the meantime we have discovered how to do it and that every attack you do on the polar mark which is from behind or when he is sleeping can deal 4 times the amount of damage. So that is really cool, you can deal 12 million damage with Ring of Chaos, you can deal over 20 million damage with a normal charged heavy attack, over 40 million damage with Fury of the Bloodline and even over 80 million damage with an overpower animation cancel. So that is insane. And it does not use the proc, it does not use the chance to deal assassin damage on a melee hit. This is working every time when you do it on a polar mark. I have two theories about how that glitch really happens and one of it is that they simply made a typo in the enemy's damage table. As you know normally we deal around 40% more damage when we hit enemies from behind. So that's a damage factor of 0.4 when we hit some normal enemies from behind. But in the line where the polar mark is added into the game data I think they made the mistake and they made a typo so that it is not 0.4 but 4.0. That is not 40% more but it is 400% the amount of damage so multiplied by 4. Another theory which I think is little more far fetched is that they wanted to make sure that we can assassinate or hit polar marks from behind whenever we do it because they are relatively strong and they wanted to make sure that we can kill them. But if you ask me the first one this typo is probably what really happened. I'm not sure but this is really ridiculous. So let's try to list all the glitches we have. We have the big horn glitch with around a factor of 1.6. I think that is also a typo, they entered the DPS value in the wrong column, not for the bow but for the melee damage instead. Then we have the polar mark glitch with a factor of 4, likely because they made a typo with the behind damage. Then we have Aris Madness with a factor of 7, a 7 times multiplier in the Greek world, just to show you the scale on how we can increase our damage when we use certain things. So the 56 million damage hit occurred because we combined two glitches into each other. We had the RS Madness glitch multiplying our damage by a factor of 7 and then additionally the polar mark glitch which multiplied that damage again by a factor of 4. So by using multiple glitches or abilities like the chance to deal assassin damage on the melee hit at the same time we can get a crazy amount of damage out of it. The more factors you have in your damage formula the more damage you will get. For example when you start with 5 million damage you multiply it by 5 you get 25. Then you find another thing which multiplies it again by 5 you get 125. Then you multiply it again you find another glitch you get suddenly over 600 million. So that's exponential growth and why we can increase the damage record by such a huge amount just by finding one more additional factor and that's exactly what happened here. Then we found out that we can combine the 5% chance to deal assassin damage which is around a factor of 12 depending on your build so that gave us not a factor of 12 but a factor of 48 to multiply our damage. So what happened when I got 1 billion damage was I had around 26 million base damage from an overpower animation cancel together with the oil port and then it was multiplied by around a factor of 12 from the 5% chance to deal assassin damage on a melee hit and then it got multiplied by 4 by the polar mark glitch. That gave me a total of around 1.2 billion damage. So that's how it all works. We use all what the game has from the base game multipliers and then we add some additional glitch multipliers to multiply our damage even further than that. That is really awesome. You can try it out on every polo mark you want. You will deal 4 times the amount of damage with Aris, Madness, Fury, Bloodline, whatever attack you want. Make sure you hit him from behind or when he is sleeping. That's a really fun 
funny trick to pull off but it is nothing really that adds to your gameplay so only for having cool numbers and show off but I wanted to show it to you anyway. I hope you still like the video please don't forget to subscribe leave me a like and see you next time.